Nurcan Coşkun, I'm working for uh, Metronic uh, International. Metronic is a, um, a uh, medical device company. If we look at the uh, difference between pharma and medical device companies, uh, in fact, uh, how we are really collecting the data, and uh, because uh, it is really the, there are operational sites uh, that we need to really collect data uh, on time. Uh, other than that, uh, I don't really see so much difference because uh, there you are collecting the data based on the uh, drug usage and uh, it is accountability. In our case, it is device accountability and uh, device usage. And uh, of course, there are uh, differences uh, for how you are collecting the adverse events or um, serious adverse events because we are also having device related effects, uh, which of course are adding uh, another uh, level and uh, checking the quality uh, from this perspective uh, as well. If we look at the difference, uh, the risk-based monitoring implementation for pharma companies and the medical device companies, in fact, I, um, I don't really see any difference because uh, the uh, endpoint uh, for all companies is really getting the quality data with uh, really focusing on the risk and doing this with quality design. So it is really starting with the risk based management, as I mentioned earlier, th rather than only focusing and uh, keeping yourself in risk-based monitoring. Here, a more important point really from beginning, starting with the quality by design, getting the really right protocol in place that you can really get the data what you want, rather than trying to get uh, all uh, other points maybe not relevant then you also need to focus on the critical data, critical processes, and really focusing on the issues or non-compliance. So therefore, um, if uh, we re look at uh, if there's any difference, actually it is just that study designs or the phases are different between these two industries. But uh, if you look at the studies, their design and conduct, uh, I don't really see any uh, differences. Therefore, as it is required by, um, maybe not required, but uh, guided and uh, given by the guidance uh, from FDA and EMA, uh, it is really applicable to pharma and medical device companies at the same level.